first cologne trail effect, like we show in the opening. It's incredibly popular in TikTok and social media. So today, we are gonna teach you how to create this cool effect. If you are interested in this topic, keep watching. Before editing, we need to choose the proper video, as the first clone trail effect works best with the video captured by the fixed camera and involves the large motion displacements. For example, walking from left to right. In addition, we need an online video background remover application for quickly removing the video background. Simply search Remove Background on Google. We can get plenty of such tools. Next, let's open up Video Prog Flagger. Import the prepared video. Add it to video track. Adjust the view of the timeline. Move the playhead to the proper position. Use a shortcut Shift and M to add a marker. Then use this icon located in the upper corner to save a snapshot for the current frame. After that, the computer will open up the saved snapshot automatically. We then use the online video background remover application to get rid of the background for the video. Afterward, we add a video without the background to Video Prog Flagger. Drag it on the overlay track. Use the Ripple Edit tool to adjust its duration for making it end at the position indicated by the marker. Then repeat these steps until we get a desired outcome. Surely, in return, we can create shadows for the man in the video, just like what we did before. After we add a marker, we remove the video background and make the video on overlay track play from the position indicated by the marker to the end. Last, we can add some details to improve the final result. For example, we can add some effects in between the positions where the shadows overlap with each other. Effects like rock, shape, glitch are good to go. Drag the selected effect to video track, then drag the ends for making it overlay the overlap section of two videos. Alternatively, we can use transition to simulate a freeze frame effect. First, we drag the playhead to the position where the shadow starts to show. Use the split tool on the toolbar to split the video on the video track, then go to transitions and find a fade to white. Drag it to the position where we just add a split point. 
then decrease the duration of the transition effect. After that, we move the video of the shadow backward a little bit for making it show after the transition. Then we can add a camera shutter sound effect. Alright, we believed you've mastered how to create this freeze clone trio effect. If you want to know more editing tricks with Video Proc Flagger, be sure to click the subscribe button to subscribe to our channel. See you in our next editing tutorial. Hope you enjoyed it. Bye!